What is going on guys? Welcome to the next part of my Super Mario 64 100% walkthrough. So if you guys haven't checked out the previous parts yet, definitely be sure to go do that. And once again, I put a lot of time into these videos, so I'd really appreciate it if you guys went and hit the like button, and also subscribe to the channel, that'd be great. And once again, I'll be putting timestamps for all the stars in the description below. So let's go ahead and jump into the video. Alright guys, so we're going to be doing quite a bit in today's video actually. So we're going to be doing the invisibility cap, MIPS, and what I consider my favorite stage in the game, Lethal Lava Land. So we're going to start by doing the invisibility cap first. So we're in the basement again. So this door right here is Hazy Maze Cave. So the door to the right, right here, this one takes you to the invisibility cap. So now, I actually already did this, so normally, if you haven't done it yet, there'd be water here. So you just have to swim through. Just uh, imagine there being water there. And then these two pillars, you actually gotta ground pound these. But again, I already did it, so that's why they didn't go down there. So once you do that, it'll actually get rid of the water, and then you can walk through this door. And then you're just going to make your way over here. So you got this hole in the ground, and this takes you to the invisibility cap stage. And there's also eight red coins in here to collect as well. So the first one, the first few are a little bit tricky, but that, there's the first one. Second one, you can just jump right to the platform. And then the other two are right down there. You can see one of them. It's really easy to get though if you're careful. So there's four, you can just jump right to the bottom now. Okay, make your way over here. So now we got these little elevator platforms here. So we got a red coin right there, so we'll grab that. There's six. You just gotta be really careful not to fall off. There's seven. And the last one is right right at the end there. So here's the uh, switch. Of course, as you can see, I already pushed it. So let's go ahead and grab an invisibility cap here. So there's the last red coin. And the star spawns right in here. So of course, you wouldn't be able to walk through this this little wall right here without the invisibility cap. So let's go ahead and grab the star. Okay, so now that we've done the invisibility cap, it's time to go do Lethal Lava Land. So I'm in the same spot where we started the video. So to access Lethal Lava Land, it's right over here, the one with the big flame on it. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Alright, so the first star we're going to be getting in here is Boil the Big Bully. So I'm going to try to show you guys what I think the easiest way is. So this platform here, you can go ahead and long jump over here. Do the same with this platform. If you get hit once or twice, it's not too big of a deal because there's a lot of coins on, along the way. Grab those, so let's jump to this thing here. So these tiles you gotta be careful because they will move. <clears throat> Just make your way over here. And then this guy right here is the big bully. So the easiest way to kill him is just by uh, leg kicking. Just like that. Knock him in the lava and there's the star. So it spawns up there and it'll give you some stairs that you gotta go across. But you gotta be quick though because they will collapse. Okay, so the next star we get is Bully the Bullies. So this one is kinda similar to the one we just did, only this one's a little bit more difficult. So we're gonna go ahead and take the exact same way. Wait for the lava there. 
Again, be careful on these platforms so you can see where the red coins are. But we'll get to that shortly. So just make your way over here. Be careful not to get hit by the lava. So you can go ahead and avoid this guy. You don't gotta worry about him. Jump on this little platform here. And you're gonna come over to where these three guys are right here. So what you gotta do is you gotta kill these by knocking them in the lava. These guys can be very annoying to kill, so uh... <laughs> and again, it's not a big deal if you get hit a couple times. So knock them in the lava and then you'll have to kill the big guy again. So again, just do leg kicks, probably the easiest way to kill him. And there's the star. Okay, so the next star we get is 8 coin puzzle with 15 pieces. So of course, like I said, we already know where the 8 red coins are. So you can just go ahead and long jump over here. Long jump to this one. So the red coins are right here. This is easily the easiest red coin star in the game. And once again, it's okay if you get hit a couple times. But uh, yeah, not much to that one at all. Really easy star there. Alright, and the next star we get is Red Hot Log Rolling. So there's a giant log, like, over that way. You can't really see it from here. That's the way that you're intended to get it, but honestly, there's a much easier way to get this star. So if you long jump over here, grab the wing cap. Just grab this, and you're going to long jump back over here. Now this jump can be a little bit tricky, but it's not too difficult. So you want to do a triple jump. And make sure when you do the triple jump, you're jumping off that arch there. And the star is right here. Like, you can just fall down, and it's right there. So, super simple. Okay, so now we're going to be getting hot-footed into the volcano, and we're also going to be getting 100 coins here. So normally I would get the 100 coins when we get the red coins, but the reason why I waited for this one is because we actually have a shell over here. Now, you don't get this until you get the first four stars in the stage, and the shell makes it a lot easier to get 100 coins in this stage. So let's go ahead and grab that. Of course, we can go on the lava with the shell. So you got some coins right over here. Let's grab those. Let's go ahead and grab the red coins here. Just got to be really careful you don't hit anything or else we'll lose the shell. Okay. Almost lost it there. I was a little close. <laughs> Alright, so of course, we're not going to worry about that star there, because we already got it. Now getting 100 coins on this stage is a little bit tricky, I will say. So I'm just going to try to show you guys where all the coins are here. I'm just going to take my time, because we got some underneath that bridge there. There we go. And you can also knock the bullies off like this too, super easily. So they'll give you a coin. Try to grab it. There we go. Okay, we've also got some over here. And there's also some here. So we got 51 already. Not gonna bother with those bullies. And over here we have an eye. So of course we know how to kill these. It's a little bit trickier to kill him on the shell, but it is possible. So we got 72 now. Okay, so we got some on this platform right here. So let's grab those. So we're up to 80 now, so let's go ahead inside the volcano. Just grab a few more here to be safe. 
All right, so you're gonna see why I decide to wait to get to the hundred coins or get the hundred coins now, I should say. So we got some coins in here, of course. Okay, avoid this guy. Now the star hot footed into the volcano. It's not too difficult, really, if you're careful. Jump on these platforms. Okay, so we got some coins right there, and there's the 100 coin star. So let's grab that. Be careful, uh, careful that bully doesn't knock you off. Alright, so now you gotta make your way across these poles, which can be a little bit tricky. So you just gotta jump from pole to pole. And the star is right over here. Alright, so the last star we get in here is Elevator Tour and the Volcano. So, as you could probably guess, we're going to go inside the volcano again. So let's do this little shortcut here. Alright, so let's go back in the volcano. So now right here, what you're going to want to do, there's a really quick little shortcut you can take. And it's super easy to do. So just jump in the lava here. And you can actually shoot right up to this elevator here. Then you can go ahead and jump on this pole. So you're going to have some fire right there. Just got to be careful to avoid that. Then you jump over to this pole. Right after these platforms. So there's the star right there. These platforms, they might look intimidating, but it's honestly pretty easy to get across. And there's the star. Okay, so the last thing we're going to be doing today is MIPS, which is the rabbit, if you guys don't know. So, I'm going to take this from the top. So, right when you enter the basement area, you're just going to go down this hallway here. So, MIPS can be extremely annoying, so I'm just going to stop here for a second. So, there's actually two stars you can get for MIPS. The first time, you grab them the first time when you first get down here, like to the basement. And then you can actually unlock him again and get a second star once you get to 50 stars. So I'm going to try to show you guys the easiest way to grab him. But this can be tricky. So you're just going to go like this. Just dive twice and grab him. I know I made that look really easy, but uh, that can be very annoying sometimes. But uh, there's a star. And once again, you get two stars for MIPS. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this one. So we did a lot today. We did the Invisibility Cap, Lethal Lava Land, which, again, is probably my favorite stage in the game. And we also did MIPS. So yeah, that's going to be it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. And once again, I put a lot of time into these videos, so I'd really appreciate it if you guys hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. That'd be great. But until then, I will see you guys in the next video.